And I want to tell you, I want to tell you another thing that I just read right now. It says when you're saying Elohai Neshama Shinatata Bi Torah, Atavirata Tai Satata Mahatabi, Atavashima Kubi. Some people, he writes over here, how do you say Elokai Neshama Shinatata Bi Torah? Some say Torah he. He says not to say that. If he said it, we don't scream at the guy. But he says, just say Elokai Neshama Shinatata Bi Torah. Don't say Torah he. He says, why? Why not say Torah he? Rabbi Yisha, you had a question? Anybody can give me an answer? You had a question, Abdo? No, so why can't you say Torah E? You know Shema's Torah, no? Is your Neshama Torah? Yes or no? You, are you, know, you know what he answers? He says, look back in your life. Did you do, do, did you do one Avon in your life? From the age of 13 till now, did you do one Avon? So already, you killed the Torah. You killed the purity of the Neshama. You can't say Torah He. How is it Torah He? Did you do one other one? You're already out of, out of the shuffle. That's what he writes down over here, Yaku Yosef on the bottom. He says, Because it's Torah. But Torah He, is it still Tahor? It's, it, it, it started off Tahor. It started off pure. But what do you, exactly? It says, Why? Says now already Torah he is it Torah he right exactly is it right now is it Tahor? You're right, uh, it's Tahor. Don't get me wrong, but the little block over there, the guy looked at something he wasn't supposed to look at. Already put some stain. Now they got to get it out with the uh, you know the detergents and this and that. What are you gonna do about that? What are you gonna do? And therefore we say Torah, but this is a big Musad. What's the big Musad? The Musad is. Don't make one avon. Because you make one avon, you're already putting more black on the neshama, black on this, black on that. This is what it is, Rabotai. And then we give the neshama back to Hashem. What is this? This is the neshama I gave you, isn't it? Look what the, what is this? And that's why we have to constantly make chufa. We have to constantly get it, eradicate any avon that we have. Make chufa now! Beyond! Hashem, I'm sorry, I'll never do that avon again in my life! And like that, Hashem forgives us, Bezad Hashem. Wipe the Avon out. Get close to Hashem before, you know, it's too late. You know what I'm saying? Let's do it now as we speak. I'm in Kenya.